these trolls are real people, to be honest. Um, you see, they said oh, yeah, they, they, they busted Eric Kamina. I'm saying I don't think they're getting paid for this shit. Like no bots or people oh. just. Hey, I think these are real people trolling. Oh, I, I I don't doubt it. You know, I was just trying to get them a, an excuse. Then I see that she had closed the page. Huh? That page Eric Kamina got busted on. Yeah. She turned to her son page and then she closed it. I'm like, you really look busted now because you could have should have left it open. Honestly, that had to be pre-planned. Like, I think that's some that was ahead of our times PR because I just can't believe someone no, love you too. Legit, to use a page like who would fumble the ball like that? You know what I'm saying? And then change it. Like you had to remember before you change the name page that you used to be a troll and that shit was gonna bite you in the fucking ass. I think she probably was still trolling on that page, to be honest. Because what I was reading, I think in some I don't remember which one of them gossip site pages, but what I was reading is that that page had a lot of followers. So right. she so wanted to keep the followers instead of starting all over, which I feel like with her status, she could have started all over anyway and got the followers. But, you know, these people this. are dumb, so. I refuse to believe that Erica Mena is a is a dummy with a cake on. Like, I, I, I refuse to believe she's a super dummy. Like you Well, after her trying to stick it out with Safari, so it's got to be on something. Baby, I wouldn't even say hello to Safari. Hello. I, I mean, I know it's like for TV, or you don't, you can't decipher what's for TV because it's like when you look at it, it's a lot of editing or a little editing or whatever. And it's like at the end of the day, one thing we have to remember is this is really these people's lives, you know? Mm -hmm. So. It's just from what you play out on social media, then reality TV, what what the fuck is real and what's not? Because you can't sit back and be like, why would you deal with this? But then you look at the situation with Rashida. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a, it's just a lot to that whole Love & Hip Hop franchise. I mean, but Rashida was straddling her husband in bed and her son walks in, like the door was unlocked. Um. That's, I don't know. I, just, I think that that thing was set up. But even with that, even with you saying that, that's whatever's going on is inappropriate. I think that they was just trying to set something up to make us believe that they had some kind of intimacy that ain't there. You know, this is still Kurt with three earrings. Yeah, I think they acting too... Um, I don't know. I think it's just really... I think it's a mixture of everything, but who's doing all of that for a check? I'm I'm straight. Love you, too. Now you got to get off this live, sis. Thank you. Who on the live? Madison. She doing okay. the Now we not about to do no key. No, we is not about to do right. You got to slide off this live. What the Okay, heck? bye. No, and don't don't just sit there and just not comment. Click off. Matter of fact, turn your phone off. Restart. Not, turn it yeah. off. Restart your damn phone. Not restart it. Yeah, restart your phone right now. I want to see. Let me see what um, mobile network your phone on. And the only way I can see it is if you restart it. The symbol will pop up. I want to see who's your phone carrier. Go ahead, restart your phone. 